Well, hey, Cornerstone, hey, church family, Pastor Rob here. Just wanted to uh, come on live and give you a quick update on what's going on for our Sunday services. Uh, as you know, we are super excited this Sunday to be able to gather together again as one congregation in one service. It's been a long time that we've been doing this two service thing to comply with all these social distancing guidelines. You know, funny enough, uh, since coming here in May of 2021, I haven't even been in a service with everybody together. So Sienna and I are personally very excited for this Sunday, and we have some great worship lined up. We've got a great service this Sunday, so we hope that you're excited as well. But before we return, we just thought it'd be good to give you a couple things to think about as you're coming back to church. So first of all, we don't need to register anymore for services but it is important that we continue to self-screen. So if you're just not feeling well Sunday morning, we just encourage you, stay home. Take advantage of the live, live stream. But if you're not feeling well, self-screen and just stay home for that Sunday. Get well and come on back the next week. Secondly, it is important that we try to get to services a little earlier than normal. Uh, it's gonna help our ushers when it comes to spacing just to make sure that we can get as many people in as we can and seated properly. So come early, get your kids settled in if you have kids, come upstairs, fellowship. You can come uh, 30 minutes before the service if you want and just hang out in the sanctuary and there's music playing. So try to make it an effort to come earlier for services on Sunday. Thirdly, when you come in Sunday, you're gonna notice the room looks a little different. Uh, the rows are a little closer together, I think we've, landed on 24 inches between the end of the seat to the next seat. I actually sat in the seats and I can put, now I'm shorter, but but I can put my feet straight up and they don't even touch the next seat. So it's kind of like first class seating in the sanctuary. Um, so there is some good spacing still, but it's going to look different than it used to. And so there, you're not going to be able to have three chairs next to you. You're not going to be able to have your Bible and your coat on the chair next to you. Um, so keep that in mind. And what we'd really encourage is maybe you know some people in the church that you're comfortable with. Maybe sit together and bubble again. That'll help us make sure that there is spacing where we need it. And so Sunday mornings, just be prepared for that. The rows are a little tighter. You're going to be uh, shoulder to shoulder with some people. So sit with some people that you're comfortable with. Fourthly, uh, for those of you who are still uncomfortable with all this loosening of social distancing uh, mandates, we do still have four rows of the high protocol zone. We've expanded the high protocol zone from two to four rows. And so if you want to sit there and you want to keep the six foot spacing, then we'd encourage you just to let the ushers know, look, we want everybody to feel comfortable to come back to church. And whether you're cool with just hugging people again and getting right up in people's grills, or if you need a little space, we wanna make sure that you're welcome. So this is, high, this is completely elective. If you wanna sit in the high protocol zone, we have it for you, just let the ushers know. Also keep in mind, if you're more mobile, that we have the balcony open as well. And generally speaking, there'll be less people up there. It's not a high protocol zone, but you can also head upstairs and sit up there if you'd like as well. And fifthly, finally, just a reminder that we are still under a masking mandate. Even though the social distancing mandates are gone, um, we still are being asked by our public health officials to wear masks in the service. So just keep that in mind as you come to church. Look, I get all the debates around masks, but the good news is that it's looking like this man masking mandate will only be around for a couple more weeks. You know, we're praying. So let's remember that as well as we come to church. But I think the most important thing that I want us to remember is this. Come hungry. Come this Sunday ready to sing, ready to fellowship, ready to raise your hands and to praise the Lord. It is going to be such a good time of singing and fellowship and prayer and of the word. John Miller is with us again, opening the scriptures for us. So church, come hungry, come ready to sing, 
come ready to worship Jesus. We're so excited for this weekend. We're really looking forward to it. So we pray that you are too, and we'll see you Sunday morning. Remember, services are at 10 o'clock. Come early, come ready, come hungry, and we'll see you there. God bless you. We love you, Cornerstone.